friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Valerie and welcome to my channel. We're glad to have each and every one of you. So today guys, we are doing a Scentsy haul. It is a small haul um, that I put in because there was one specific item that came out that I wanted to make sure that I got. Um, so um, I just have three bars and then this other item. So let's get into it right away. So I was a little late to the game guys. I did get the Easter collection. Um, okay, and I ordered it on the 1st, April 1st, and I got it the day before Easter, so I was really surprised that I even got it, um, that soon. So, we're going to go through the bars. Um, I did warm some of them. I warmed all three of them. Um, I think I warmed this one in my bedroom first on Saturday, and then Sunday I warmed these two. Well, actually, no. I think I warmed these two on Saturday, Sunday, and I warmed this one on Saturday. So, anyway... Let's get into it, guys. I need to put my glasses on so I can see, kind of see what I'm doing here. All right, so the first one let's talk about is Mandarin Zest. And it is a light pastel yellow. And the notes are sweet mandarin, watery pear, and vanilla. And it is very, very light. This one is super duper light. And I do smell the mandarin, and I think the pears in there, I don't smell that like as a standout, but it's sweet. It's I think the pear sweetens it up. So, um, and I was kind of concerned with it being watery. I don't like aquatic notes, but this is not like that. It's actually pretty good. I like the scent, and then you can smell that vanilla creaming it out a little bit. So it's like a sweet mandarin, um, creamy scent and I like that I really do like that the only thing is guys it was so light I mean I put two cubes in my bedroom and within a few hours it was gone and I kind of could faintly smell a little something but for the most part it was gone so this is not going to be a repurchase for me all right but it was a good scent so I'm glad I got it and tried it anyway so that was Mandarin Zest. Okay, the next one was Pink Berry Fluff. And this is the main one, the reason why I ordered this, these bars is because I wanted to try this Pink Berry Fluff. Um, I love sweet marshmallow -y stuff. So this was, uh, notes are Pink Berry, Marshmallow, and Vanilla Bean. Beautiful uh, pastel pink wax. This is wonderful. I've said it before with other scents, but this reminds me of Glade's Sheer Vanilla Embrace. The plug-in. Mm, it smells, it's got that note in there. I don't want, know what note it is. Um, they, the vanilla, of course, they share, but I don't know. And then when it's warming, it smells that way too. I love this one. And then that marshmallow comes out and it, oh. This one is really, really good. This one is in my club um, because I don't want the um, Mandarin Zest and they come in a three pack. So if you don't want the three pack guys, you can put them in your club and get them individually. Get the individual ones you want. And if you want them right away, go ahead and put them in your club, do an in and out club, uh, starter club and put them in there and have it shipped right away to you. That way you get them. Um, I don't know how long this is going to stay uh, out. This is a limited time offer. and But this one I love. It has, it's kind of perfumey. Um, it is, yeah, it's perfumey. It's sweet. It's got that marshmallow in there. I love this one. And it's it's performing. It performed very well for me. It actually really did. So, I uh, yeah, I am getting more of this one. It is already in my club. I already put it in my clubs. So, Pinkberry Fluff. Okay. okay. All right, the next one is Violet Sponge Sugar. And for those of you who don't know, my little doggie is named Violet. So, of course, I had to try this. All right, and I'm not, I've never really, wasn't certain whether I liked Violet or not. I've, not, I've tried, I've gotten like one bar, I think, in the past that has some Violet. Not from Scentsy, from retail, but it's got a pretty lilac color pastel, colored wax. And this has got notes of... Tart Cloudberries, Violet Water, and Sponge Sugar. Now, I love Cloudberry Dream. I don't know if this shares the same, some of the same notes as Cloudberry Dream, but it smells nothing like Cloudberry Dream. 
so that that the cloudberry is tart there is a little bit of a tartness there but there is also a sweetness and it that's coming from that sugar sponge sugar which is like sponge sugar i think is cotton candy and then there is i don't want to say it's floral to me it's more like a perfume note that i think is coming from the violet and I love this one. I really, really love this one. Now, a lot of people say this is very similar to Skyburst Star or Star Scarburst Sky. I did not get Starburst Sky, and I was had it in my club to get it to try it. But so many, somebody, so many people said this is so similar to it, but this one was stronger. And the only difference was like the beginning of the scent was different, but then it ends the same. And I love the beginning of this one. So I'm not going to try Starburst Sky, guys. I'm not doing, doing it. A lot of people say it has kind of a smoky note in there. And like a cigarette smoke. And I'm an ex-smoker, so I'm very sensitive to cigarette smoke. So any little bit of it, I can sense, I can smell it. And it just turns my stomach. So I'm just, I just decided not to try that one. So I like this one, though. And then after this, the violet, and, the, and it kind of wears off after a while... I get a Baccarat, Baccarat Rouge 540 scent, and it it was good. I did one cube out here, and this is, I think, the strongest out of the three, but I did one cube out here in my open concept in a 20-watt um, uh, element warmer, and it went, like, two days. It's been going two days, okay, guys? And I think I put it in Sunday... Maybe Saturday. I may have put it in Saturday, but I warmed it all day yesterday, Sunday. And then I just took it out this morning. It's good. It's really good. This is going to my club. It's staying in my club. Um, so, yeah, I think I'm going to do an in and out club because I want to do, I want to get um, some of the bars from um, the bricks. I want to try some of the bars from the bricks. I think there's three I'm going to try. Um, so, I think I'm only going to get three bars for that. And then I'm going to get two bars of these. And um, I don't know what else. I don't know if I'm going to get the um, Epcot or not. I'm trying to stay away from L L LTOs, limited time offers, because I want to concentrate more on things that are in the catalog this year. Um, I missed out on a lot last spring and summer, so I went to get an order place for some of the stuff that I didn't get to try last year. And they've added some new stuff, too, that I want to try as well. Um, but I, I really do want to stay, stick with the, the uh, catalog stuff and I want to restock on things that I loved last year. So, sorry guys, if you're new, I do drink on my channel. Sorry if that offends you, but my mouth and throat gets so dry. Okay guys, the next thing that I got, this is the main reason I placed the order, is I got a wolf box. Yeah, not a whiff box, a wolf box, W-O-O-F box. So they have, uh, they did away with the pet supply stuff, the pet stuff, um, this fall or this spring and summer catalog. So they are bringing out LTOs for pet, pet supply stuff, pet stuff, and uh, wolf box is one of the things. Now, the only thing is, is it came in a whiff box. All right, Sensi, I think it should, you should have got boxes that said wolf box on it, okay, to be honest. You're making us wait, not, not get these all the time, not be able to order uh, pet supplies all the time. So at least you could do is put wolf on there instead of whiff. That's, that's one critique I have. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it. You know, I'm just going to be a grouch and I'm going to complain and start just saying it. Oh, the floral, the flowers kind of match my little dress. You like my dress? This is a new dress from Nadine West, guys. Check out my Nadine West video. I'm going to be getting that up soon if it's not up already. Okay, and this is what it looks like when you open it. I do love the plan words set with love. Okay, and there we go. That's what we have in there. All right, let's go and let's dive in. Now, I have tried um, these uh, pet supply or pet products from Sensi, and they are really good products. Um, they make Violet's coat so fluffy and soft and conditioned. And it, they get her clean, and she smells so good. And um, when I use them and everything, so um, I definitely, definitely will be keeping this. All right, or trying to get these as soon, whenever they come available. I have a little stockpile, not big stockpile. But I have I have one other shampoo, and I have a no not another no not detangling spray, and I have another fr another freshen up pup. 
I think I might have two Freshen Up Puffs. Um, so I wanted to get a, this one because the scent, this the scent I didn't have. And I love this scent. I love it in wax and I just really do like this scent. So um, this came out in uh, Black Raspberry Vanilla. So I got Best Bud Suds, the sh pet shampoo, in Black Raspberry Vanilla. So this stuff is really, really good. This one makes your coat really fluffy. It's very conditioning. So if your pet has sensitive uh, skin, um, that you know has they flake and they get dandruff and that kind of stuff because they do have they do get some dogs have very sensitive cuts coats and skins and stuff um violet never really did but i've always used very like aloe um based products on her chamomile based products on her um and i don't shampoo her a lot um they say that when you start shampooing a lot it kind of strips a lot of their natural oils out so she does get regular baths but she does not get them like constantly because I don't want that to happen um, to her coat you know I want her to be healthy so shampoo love it and this is 16 ounces guys okay this whole box was $30 US um, I didn't think that was too bad because this is normally 15 by itself so uh, we'll go over a little pricing here after a bit all right, so then I got the, the also came with it, is the No Nut Dog Detangling Spray in Black Reservoir Vanilla as well. Now, Violet doesn't have a long coat, so her, her coat doesn't get tangled up. But I thought, well, I can use it, always use it as a de uh, deodorant type spray if I run out of the other stuff. Um, but I heard a lot of humans are using this on their hair. And my hair is very, very tangly, so I thought... Okay, if nothing else, I may use it on my hair. I'm going to check it out and try it out and see what it does. Because once I shampoo my hair from here down all the way around, it's nothing but a big knot. And I have to take detangling spray and put it through my hair. And I have to use a pick just to kind of pick it all up. And it takes me a good 15 minutes or so to get all the knots and tangles and everything out of my hair. Because my hair is so fine. So even if I use a good conditioner and I use a good conditioning shampoo... It's just, and then you got to be careful because then my hair is very fine and it gets weighted down too easy. So, no not uh, spot. Uh, we'll try it out. See how, see what goes, see how it works. Okay, this is a, a deodorizing spray, Freshen Up Pup deodorizing spray, also in black raspberry vanilla. It smells good, guys. Okay, I'm going to shake it up. Make sure you shake these up good when you first get them because one of them that I tried... I like couldn't smell it very well and then I really started shaking it up and mm. yeah, it smells like black raspberry vanilla so I can't wait to use that on her I haven't used it on her because it was cold when it came in and I didn't want to spray it on her and get her all cold so it is sprayed yodelizer um these have really good ingredients as well let's see um what it says mm. Thought there was a thing on here that's had all the good ingredients on it. <laughs> well, I'm not seeing a whole lot, guys. Sorry. Has path panthenol, um, colloidal oatmeal extract, uh, aloe. So yeah, it has some good stuff in here really good stuff so she does get conditioned she's so soft too all right guys we got two more items okay i got a sample of best buds pet shampoo and honey and chamomile so i don't know if honey and chamomile might be the next scent that they bring out in an lto uh, or in a wolf box i don't know if the wolf box is going to be oh, sorry about my hair is going to be available every month or if it's just going to be every so often. They've not given us any information. I do know you cannot put the Wolf Box in your club, Scentsy Club, or I don't think you can either. I don't think you can do them as party rewards either. So you're going to always pay full price for the Wolf Box, all right? And then they did give us a little Scentsy Ball. This is Scentsy Pets, which is kind of cute, little paw. As a toy for Vivi. So she'll rip this all to shreds. She's a little thing, but she rips everything up big time. So that is my wolf box, guys. Um, let me know what you think. Okay, let's go over pricing before I forget. $15. 
And I believe both of these are $10 each. So that was uh, $20, $35 right there. So I got, you know, my money's worth out of it there. Samples, I don't know. And the ball, I don't know. So, you know, I got a couple extras and that kind of thing. This thing, I'm not real certain I'm kind of excited about because if I can't go purchase it right away um, in the catalog, then, um, and they don't bring it back in Wolf Box, Wolf Box or in LTO, why would you give me this? You know, that, that, why would you give me this to try if you're not going to bring it back? Because that to me is just, um, like teasing, you know, <laughs> here, try this. And if you love it, oh, well, because you can't get any more of it. Now, I don't know what their plans are with that. So I'm kind of, eh, not thrilled with that. But these other products, these three, yeah, these three, I really am. So, um, I'm, I'm really happy with, with what I've got. So that's my little haul, guys. Um, I'm going to get off of here before I get too long-winded. And I hope you guys had a great Easter. I hope you guys are having a great week. Um, I don't know when I'll get this uploaded, but I do know it's already after Easter. So um, I had a really nice Easter weekend. Um, so um, I hope everybody else did too. So um, I think I already went over what you guys need to do um, on my video. Uh, like, subscribe, comment, uh, click the notification bell. Maybe I didn't do all that. Did I do all that? Maybe I did that on my other video that I just did. So do all those things. And if you're new, please subscribe. It's free. Um, we're almost a thousand subscribers, guys. We're at 893, I think, or 883, something like that. So we're getting close. When we get to a thousand, we're going to do a giveaway. We're going to do a giveaway. Yay. Um, so I'm trying to get my Nadine West uh, stuff uploaded. I get them filmed and get them uploaded. I haven't done them for a while. So I'm going to, I'm trying to bring those back. Um, we're doing, I have, you know, hauls that we do for Scentsy. Um, I am an independent Scentsy consultant. So if you want to try any of these products or bars, not specifically these products, because these you can get now. This you can get now. The Wolf Box, I'm sorry, is available as well as supplies last until the end of April let you guys know that um after that i don't know so if you want any of these products i, I always leave my link below for my website um, you can go on there and order them through there um, always just make sure you click on a party link so that somebody's getting credit um, for the the sale as far as uh free items and if i get the sale if i get the free items it does help me promote products on my channel and it does help me to give samples and uh, get them out to my customers. So keep that in mind, guys. And so I love you guys so much. And I'm going to get off of here. And I will see you next video. All right, bye-bye.